rest in the finished work. John chapter 19 verse 30 So when Jesus had received the sour wine, he said, It is finished. And bowing his head, he gave up his spirit. It's always commendable to put our best effort, into whatever we do, there's nothing wrong with giving 110% to something. However, there's something to be said about rest. If we think of ourselves, as the source of our success in life, we'll run ourselves ragged with little to no results. Thankfully, Jesus has done everything necessary, for us to succeed. Jesus declared, it is finished, before he bowed his head, and gave up his spirit. If we wonder exactly what it was that he finished, he was referring to everything that pertains to life, and godliness including our success. We tap into this success through the knowledge of Him, who called us to glory in virtue. We can never make ourselves successful, this comes through a personal relationship with Christ. It's okay to have good things in life, the difference between the believer and the world, is our mindset. Working hard through our self-efforts, only leaves us burned out, exhausted, and frustrated. Believing that God wants us to be successful, positions us to receive success from Him. The only work necessity on our part, is to believe in the one He sent. Resting doesn't mean inactivity, hard work is fine, as long as we rest in the finished works of Christ, while we work. To rest the way God intends means, to confidently set aside any worry or anxiety, and trust in His Son. Jesus Christ is our Sabbath and our rest. Entering into His presence gives us rest from our labors, in the same way God is resting from His. We must labor to enter into that rest, and not fall into unbelief on this point. It's well worth the effort. Thanks for watching. If you are blessed by this video, please don't forget to like and comment. Feel free to share with someone who needs God's grace right now. Kindly subscribe and click the bell icon to get notified. And watch other inspirational videos like this.